In this video, we will create an example options trading system using the OptionStack platform. The trading system we will create will enter bullish trades when the market is considered oversold and will enter bearish trades when the market is considered overbought. Specifically, we will use the RSI indicator, the relative strength index, to determine whether the market is overbought or oversold. The RSI is a momentum oscillator that measures the speed and change of price movements. The RSI oscillates between 0 and 100. Traditionally, markets are often considered oversold when the RSI crosses below 30 and overbought when the RSI crosses above 70. Therefore, we will create an options trading system that buys call options when the RSI crosses below 30 and buys put options when the RSI crosses above 70. So let's get started. First, let's select the new strategy from the file menu. A generic template will be created where you can define your trading system. The template is defined using visual blocks. The visual blocks can be dragged and dropped to define complex trading strategies and rules. There is a toolbar on the left which contains a list of available blocks that you can drag and drop onto the main canvas. Let's start from scratch by deleting some of the blocks from the generic template by dragging the blocks into the trash can. Now let's define the rules of our trading system. We will use the when do block to define rules when we should enter into a trade. The when portion of the block is where you define the market condition you are interested in. And the do portion of the block is where you define the action to take when the desired condition is met. In our case, we want to define when the RSI crosses below 30, do buy a call option. So let's start by defining the condition when the RSI crosses below 30. Let's drag and drop one of the technical studies block from the left toolbar and place it into the when portion of the block. Change the drop down from moving average to RSI. Next, drag and drop a number block from the toolbar. Change the number block to 30 from the default value of 10. Now change the comparison drop down to crosses below. We've just created a trading rule to check for when the RSI crosses below 30. Now let's define what to do when the RSI crosses below 30. Since the RSI crossing below 30 is an oversold condition, and hence a potentially bullish condition, we would want to buy call options. So let's drag and drop a strategy block from the toolbar and place it in the do portion of the when block. Let's change the strategy to buy a call option. We can modify the filters in the strategy block to define exactly the type of call option we want to buy. Let's change the days till expiration to 45 to 60 days till expiration. And let's add a filter to only select call options with an absolute delta of 50 to 60 deltas. Drag and drop a strategy filter from the toolbar and place it inside the strategy block and change the drop down to absolute delta. Then adjust the values to be 50 to 60. You can click on the magnifying glass icon to preview the types of call options that will be selected by your filters. You can also double click on any of the candidate call options to see more detailed information and risk graphs. We have now created the first part of our trading system, 
which is to buy call options whenever the RSI crosses below 30, which is considered a potentially bullish condition. Let's define the second half of our trading system, which is to buy put options whenever the RSI crosses above 70, which is a potentially bearish condition. Although we can repeat the steps we used to create the first half of our trading system, let's use a shortcut by duplicating and modifying the first half of our trading system. Select the WHEN block and right-click it on it to see the available options. Let's select the duplicate options to copy the entire block and contents. Drag and drop the duplicated blocks below the first set of blocks. Now let's modify the lower blocks to define the desired rules. Let's change the crosses below to crosses above. And change the value from 30 to 70. And let's change the call option to put option. We have just created the trading rules to buy put options when the RSI crosses above 70. We can click on the magnifying glass icon to pre preview the types of put options that will be selected. We've now finished creating our trading system of buying put options whenever the market is considered overbought and buying call options whenever the market is considered oversold. Now let's evaluate the performance of our trading system. Click on the Run Backtest button to evaluate the performance of our trading system. The results of our trading system will be displayed on the Strategy Results panel. You can double click on any of the transactions to view the detailed risk graphs of the transactions that were placed. You can easily adjust any of the trading rules to quickly tune and optimize your trading system. As you can see, OptionStack makes it easy to create, backtest, and optimize your options trading systems. If you have any questions or feedback, please visit our website for additional tutorials and information. Thank you for using the OptionStack platform.